everyone and welcome to Sharpest Gaming and today we're back with our Pokemon Yellow Nuzlocke celebrating 20 years of Pokemon. Now, uh, crack some little fingers here, crack me little fingers. I don't think I did any um, training off screen, but just so you guys are aware, we have level 30 Onyx, level 29 Primate, level 27 Needle King, level 30 Gyarados, level 31 uh, Charmeleon, level 32 Pidgeotto. Now last time, I originally said, hey, we're going to take on Sabrina this episode. I don't know if that's going to happen. So Sabrina is level 43 Alakazam. Um, I should have checked Koga to see what his levels were. I did not. Actually, let me do that now because maybe that's what we'll do in today's episode if that's, if it's the case of Koga being, um, not super high leveled. But yeah, so, uh, Sabrina is level what am I trying to find here? There we go. Um, Sabrina's level 43 Alakazam, which, as you saw, we our level 32 Pokemon was our highest one. Okay, so Koga's also level 43 with Huizun. Um, I think we could actually deal with Koga a little bit better, though. So maybe, let's do Koga today, guys. We're going to go do Koga today. Not like that. And, um... Yeah, we'll move on from there. Because I kind of want to do the fighting dojo. You know what? Fighting dojo and Koga today. And Snorlax. Little bit, little bit weird. Little bit weird. Um, but I feel at this point we have a better chance against Koga. You know what? Let's do Snorlax, fighting gym. And then we'll see how we feel after the fighting gym. Maybe we'll do Sabrina today. Because... I'm pretty sure we're not going to be able to. My main Pokemon for Sabrina right now is going to be Gyarados, and Gyarados is only level 30. So I want to get Gyarados leveled up before we take on Sabrina. To, like, maybe 40 at the lowest. But let's take on the Snorlax. A sleeping Pokemon blocks the way. Oh, we have to actually physically play the Poke Flute. Oh, I can drop that card key, too. Snorlax woke up. It attacked in a grumpy rage. <sighs> Snor. All right. Wild Snorlax appeared. Jasmine. I brought out Onyx first, just because um, Onyx can take hits from Snorlax. Amnesia won't be a problem for us because we aren't a special attacker. I'm just trying to paralyze it right now. Okay, he has Amnesia. Has a headbutt. Does I think it has rest. So all of these, yep, it does have rest. So all of those body slams were for not. Not that we got to paralyze anyway. Let's see how much rock slide does this thing. We saw headbutt only did eight points of damage. Oh wow, rock slide does nothing. How much is this? Oh, I've got earthquake by the way. Earthquake was in uh, Sylphco. Sylphco. I didn't know that it was there. I thought it was at Victory Road because it typically is. But I gave earthquake to Onyx, even though it already had dig. Okay, that's doing okay damage. We see Snorlax wake up here. Let's hit it with another Earth. Another Quake of the Earth. I don't know that Rest is guaranteed two turns in this game. I think it might not be. Paralyze. Damn it! Ah, I hate you, Snorlax. You're the worst! Um... Yeah, I don't know that rest is guaranteed two turns. Let's actually figure that out right now. So this would be its first turn of rest. Also, this is getting annoying how little damage we're doing. So I'm going to screech it. This is... Oh, okay. So yeah, it's not guaranteed because it woke up early there. All right, let's see how much Earthquake does now. Ooh, that did okay damage. But it did so much damage that I don't want to hit it again. So we're just going to toss a great ball. Hope for the best. Hope for the best. Damn it, Snorlax. Rest. Bastard. Now it won't rest when I want it to. Come on. Come on, Snorlax. Get in the ball. I only have so many. There we go. There we go, Snorlax. Proud of you. Now don't wake up for a long time. Now don't wake up for a long time. Let me get two earthquakes off and stay asleep oh now earthquakes doing a little too much i 
think Rockslide will do too much too. Ooh, Body Slam didn't do enough. It didn't do enough that time. So if it rests again, we're gonna Earthquake and then Rock Slide. We're gonna Earthquake and then Rock Slide if it rests again. One, two. Yeah, never mind, we got it. No. We'll eat anything, even if the food happens to be a little moldy. It never gets an upset stomach. Sounds like me. Low key, I am a Snorlax. In fact, I was trying to think of a name, because I don't think I have a name for Snorlax. I have a name for Munchlax. Blueberry. Hey, Blueberry. Um, so I'm going to name him Low key. Low key the Snorlax. And Snorlax could also be a really good Pokemon for uh, Sabrina, so. So there's always that option. But we're gonna go heal up. Not that we really need to. Just Onyx need on them. Just Onyx needs to. And then um, I'm actually gonna go and get our encounter for Cycle Road. For Cycling Road, my boy. My boy, Cycling Road. Cycling road. And I kind of want to just leave that other Snorlax alone. Just in case we end up using the Snorlax and it dies and I can go catch it, you know? We can save it for our, the final episode where we go around and capture all the Pokemon we didn't end up cap Or go around to places we didn't end up capturing Pokemon at. I like to just, like, stare myself at the webcam. And it looks weird because it looks like I'm looking at... Actually, it kind of looks like I'm looking at the game. Like, what's going on over that? But I'm actually staring at myself in the webcam, which is kind of off this side. Well, actually, this spot where I have my webcam. I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. All right, we can get past everybody. All right. And our encounter, I think, is guaranteed to be Ponyta, if I'm not mistaken. Dodua, we already have. We already have a Dodua. Dodua. A Dodua. Hey, you stop that. You stop that. This Onyx is pretty brutal right now. Body Slam, Rock Slide, Earthquake, and Screech. I'm loving this moveset on Onyx. I mean, I'd never run that competitively. Maybe Rock Slide and Earthquake, but not Screech for sure. But it works out really well in game. It does, it does. It does, it does. Can we find a Ponita? Firo. Yeah. And I especially want to level up Onyx if we're planning on taking on Koga first. Just because Onyx will be our best option in that gym. Other than the Hypnos that are running around. Yay, Onyx. Proud of you. Onyx has come so far. It started off as a really good member and it just keeps adding to that. Uh, I mean... Oh, Ponyta! Ponyta! Um, I don't know what that was. I mean, outside of missing Rock Slide every other turn, Onyx has proved itself a valuable member to this team. Don't get burned. Don't get burned. Don't get, don't get, don't get burned. Thank you, God. And perfect. Let's get that great ball on that Ponyta. Or Ponyta. Yay! Bonita. Capable of jumping incredibly high, its hooves and sturdy legs absorb the impact of hard landing. Yes, so I nickname my Ponyta and my Rapidash Rua, or however you want to pronounce that, and it's short for Robot Unicorn Attack, if you guys ever played that game. I loved Robot Unicorn Attack when I first... Uh, for or when I was in college back in my day. Oh, jeez. I didn't expect to shoot off all of a sudden. Maybe I'll play U Robot Unicorn Attack on the channel someday. Just for fun. It's I love that game. I do love that game. Oh, let me tell you about it. I think there's somebody that wants to trade in here. But I think it's like Doug Trio for Lickitung. Nope. Actually, I think Red and Blue is Doug Trio for Lickitung. And then in these games, I think it's Slowbro for Lickitung. Or maybe, or maybe it's Doug Trio for Lickitung in this game and Slowbro for Lickitung in the other game. I can't remember, because we got Lickitung when we played Pokemon Red. 
I loved it. Marky Mark. Marky Mark, the Lickitung. But yeah, we got our Ponyta, we got our Snorlax. So now let's go back to Saffron, and we'll go in the Fighting Dojo. And we're not going to use Onyx in the Fighting Dojo, so I really don't care about level... I mean, a level. I really don't care about healing it. We're going to mostly ride on Pidgeotto and its wings. I want to get Pidgeotto to a Pidgeot as soon as possible. A sh ASAP, as the kids say. So let's go and battle the Fighting Dojo. And I think I need a free space in my team, actually, to go and... Or to uh, get the gift Pokemon at the end. So I think we'll just go drop Onyx right now. Just because we don't need him in this gym. Or is there a Pokemon that's weaker to fighting types that we have? We have Charmeleon, we have Needle King, we have Primeape, we have Pidgeotto, Gyarados. No, Onyx is going to be the one that we're not going to use. Although I think Onyx will probably take attacks pretty well, just because it's so physically defensive. I don't think we'll need her. I don't think we'll need her in this gym at all. I'm hoping that Pidgeotto can just solo through the gym. But we all know Pidgeotto. Alright, I don't and I don't know how close I'm getting to filling my box one either, so I hopefully want to figure that out before we get an encounter. That's gonna Screw us. Oh, I can drop off the card cue I'm here, too. Get rid of that item. And this... Actually, this might be the episode itself, to be honest with you guys. To be honest with you guys... Oh, I have a rare candy. I forgot I got a rare candy. I don't know where I got it. Um, oh, it must have been after... It must have been in the uh, thing. The, uh, the doodily. The uh, last oof go. What's HMO? I'm not HM, TM03. It's Swords Dance. I don't know that I'll ever need to use that. But we'll keep it around just in case. Just in case I want to teach it to Amani. Actually, we could. I don't know if Scyther has it already or gets it naturally. We can give it to Scyther once we get Scyther. 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 Can we get Scyther in this game? Naturally? I don't know. I don't know what I've been told. But his little pidge out front so we can kick some butt. Sure enough. Sure enough. I wonder... I don't know if his Hitmonchan has Thunder Punch. It's going to be the only thing that's going to be scary in this gym. Because I don't think any fighting types get Rock Slide or Rock Throw naturally. So he should be fine there. It'll just be if Hitmonchan has Thunder Punch towards the end. Which we'll just have to make sure Pidgeot does have full health for that. We'll just have to make sure Pidgeotto's have full health for that. Can we just, like, one-shot everything? Oh, okay, never mind. Never mind, Pidgeotto. I mean, Karate Chop's gonna be annoying in this gym because of critical hits. And it's not... I mean, it's not... Uh, no fighting time was resisted. Because Pidgeotto has to be part normal, like every other freaking bird. Level 33. Not bad. Already one step closer. Mankey should get one shot. Right, Pidgeotto? Especially after that level. Pidgeotto, you suck. You suck and I hate you. You're the worst Pokemon. Oh, Fury Swipes. Oh, it only hit twice. Swift attack. Swift! Critical hit on that Swift. Pidgeotto, why couldn't you just critical hit with the wing attack? Primeape! Primeape! X attack. Fatal mistake. You rookie. Grasshopper. Crit. Damn. What are you doing, dude? What are you doing, dude? Because you're dead now. See you in hell. Thought I was going to crit him the first time. Not that it really mattered, but keep getting the useless crits, Pidgeotto. Pidgeotto? Oof. I give up. Looks like you gave up as soon as Primeape came in. I hear you're good. Show me. No. No, I won't show you. All right, we have Machat, Machat. Oh, 32 this time. Actually, I think it was 32. La no, it was 31. All those Pokemon were 31. Oh, come on, Pidgeotto. Come on, Pidgeotto. Come on, Pidgeotto. 
All right, and a Machoke. Machoke. Watch me get crit by Karate Chop. Uh, crit him, crit him, Pajoto. Damn it. And you, Leer, as well, idiot. Wing attack. It's not going to knock him out. It won't knock him out. And then he Karate Chops, but he misses. Whoo, that was almost bad. Swift. See you in hell, Machoke. Level 34. Damn it. Damn it, all. I mean, if we can get to level 35... Why doesn't this gym have its own music? It's a stupid Saffron City music. Um, if we get to level 35, we got that rare candy, so... Uh, prime Ape! Prime Ape! Oh, this thing's level 36. What happened? X attack. What happened that it all of a sudden jumped to level 36? Critical hit. Good job, Pidgeot. I'm proud of you. Uh, oh, wait. Focus energy is dumb in this game, and it makes it so you don't get crits. Good job, Primeape, you freaking idiot. Super effective. See you in hell. Now, if that doesn't get me level 34, I don't know what will. Yes. Yes, we need two more levels. We need two more levels. We need two more levels. I wonder where they're at. Hello, take your shoes off. No. 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 I won't take my shoes off. I've got foot odor. Banky. Level 31. Back down to level 31. All right, Pidgeotto. We just need to get to level 35. If we can get to level 35 here at in this battle right now, Right meow. Then I can evolve to a pi oh jeez, that did more than I expected it to. Then I can evolve to a Pidgeot right before the gym battle. It'll be hype. It'll be hype alicious definition. Make the girls go crazy, Minky. Okay. Um, I'm going to heal. I only have hyper potions. All right. All right. Pidgeotto is tied with Gyarados for our highest HP Pokemon. Oh, even a crit wouldn't have knocked us out. That's cool. I'm going to fly. I'm going to see if I can knock out a fly. Focus energy, you big dumb idiot. You just made your best move useless. Just made your best move useless. Not that it matters. Not that it matters. You dumb manky. And a primary... Is this one level 36 again? Nope, level 31 again. I'm going to fly... Karate Chop. Ooh, he outspeeds. And he got the crit. He got the crit. Fury Swipes, huh? Knock him out, Pidgeotto. See you in hell, Primate. Now give me that level 35. Damn it. Damn it, so close. So bloody close. Um, let's see here. Oh, so freaking close. We're doing... We're... We're... we're blah, 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 blah. We are leveling up this Pidgeotto before the match. We are getting him to a Pidgeot before the battle. Because it will be so hype. So I'll just go battle like the first trainer in Sabrina's gym and we'll be fine. Then we'll be fine. Alright, so we gotta heal up first, obviously. So... What I'll do, what I'll do, and I'll just bring Pidgeotto and I'll swap it into Gyarados. And it'll be perfect. It'll be like a dream come true. And then that'll be the episode. Just the just the Karate Master. I didn't think the Karate Master would take as long as it did, but we're already at 20 minutes, so... Then Snorlax. I guess we could have won and got the other Snorlax, or beat it up. No, wait. We already decided what we're going to do with that Snorlax. We're going to save it in case we use this Snorlax and kill it. Like the idiots we are. I mean, we've only had two deaths so far in this game. Which, I guess is good because this isn't that hard of a game. Yeah, we definitely need to level up before Sabrina and Koga, though, because wouldn't be a good idea. Wouldn't not be a good idea. Pidgeotto against a Slowpoke. I was expecting it not to be a Slowpoke. For some reason, I was expecting it to be a... Not Slowpoke. <laughs> what am I trying to say? 
A uh, Ghastly, which doesn't make any sense. I don't know why I thought that. Gyarados, yes. Take that hit. Uh, I'm just going to Dragon Rage. You know, I think Bite will do plenty of damage to Slowpoke. I keep thinking Slowpoke's super defensive. Where is that slow bro? I don't, I don't know Slowpoke's stats. Probably not great. Okay. That Growl is really doing us in, though. So we can just Dragon Rage again. And that should be enough. Oh, come on, Gyarados. Gyarados, come on, my dude. Crit. Now it gets the crit. Level 35. Perfect. That's all we needed. That's all we needed. I guess Gyarados can stay in. See how much takedown does. Nothing. Hooray. Okay, good. I was going to say, don't disable my Dragon Rage. It's the only thing I have. <laughs> I think he has a slow bro as his last Pokemon because I, I just looked up this gym and it showed all the trainers and I remember seeing a guy with two slow pokes as a slow bro sure enough there's slow bro hooray slow bro yeah don't be dragon rage thank god alright yeah, there's a Slowbro in the Elite Four, and that could be a problem if we don't have the right Pokemon at that point. Stop growling. It doesn't do anything. All right, cool. Yeah, Slowbro could definitely be a problem if we don't plan for it accordingly. I think Gyarados gets Thunderbolt, so if it comes down to it, I'll just give Thunderbolt to Gyarados. But we can get the uh, poop out of here, so we got our level. We can walk over here. And it's time. It's time for our first Sage 2 Pokemon to emerge. Pidgeotto, eat this candy. <laughs> Shove it down his throat. What? Little Pidge is evolving. Pidgeot, I love you. This is the first time I've had a Pidgeot in a playthrough. Since my first time I played Pokemon Yellow, as a child, little kindergartner. All right, attack 77, defense 69, speed 78, special 65. Not bad, Pidgeotto. All right, Pidgeotto, let's go teach these fighting losers how it's really done. Don't have Thunder Punch, please. Grunt, I am the Karate Master. I am the leader here. You wish to challenge us? Expect no mercy. For what? Excuse me. Uh, but Black Belt wants to fight. He sets out Hitmonlee. Level 37. Pidgeotto. A little underleveled, I know. But you can do it. Fly. Fly with all your might. X attack. When I come down, this is going to hurt. Unless you want hit KO, Pidgeotto. Yes. 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 All right. Now, Hitmonchan. X attack. Oh god. Hitmonchan has more defense too than him on Lee. Come on, Pidgeotto. I believe in you! Damn it, don't thunder punch me. Fire punch, you're an idiot. I think he gets all the elemental moves at the same level. But then again, Thunder Punch is special in this game. I just remembered. I was about to get him on Chan, but then I remembered how terrible it actually is in this game. And most games, to be honest with you. Hwa, are beaten. I have been beaten by you. Indeed, I have lost. But I uh, beseech you, do not take our emblem as your trophy. In return, I will give you a prize to fight in Pokemon. Choose whichever one you like. Give me the badge. Bim -bum. You want the hard kicking Hitmon Lee? Or do you want the uh, punching uh, Hitmon Chan? I'm taking a Hitmon Lee. I already talked about it. Oh, Hitmon Chan kind of sucks in this game. Because a bunch of moves are all that special. I'm going to stop doing that that voice. So I don't upset people. What do I nickname my Hitmonlees? I don't think I have a nickname for Hitmonlee because I never use it. How about... Leggy McKicker. I don't think that'll fit. Leggy... Yeah, Leggy McKicker will definitely not fit. Let's just name him Leggy. Dumb name I know, but... I don't care. We probably won't use them. We probably won't use them because right now we have Primate 
and um, once Primeape dies, I have plenty of other Pokemon I want to use outside of Hitmon Lee. But I mean, Hitmon Lee could show up in a later game because if you guys didn't know, we do, we do in fact carry all of our surviving Pokemon into the next game because we're going to be playing um, one main series game from every generation. So there is that. So let's deposit Leggy. Boom, boom. I want to, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. I think 20 is the most, and now it's done to 17 because I have Jasmine. Because I have Jasmine. Let me, let me see if it shows you in change box how many they can hold. Nope. Sure shit they don't. I don't know. I don't know how to tell if you're almost full or not. That's what dumb is, well, that's what's dumb about this game. All right, there's there's plenty that's dumb about this game. It was the pioneer after all. Things were going to be wrong. All right. But I think with that, that's going to be the end of this episode, guys. So next time for sure. Actually, should I do Sabrina next time or Koga next time? You guys let me know in the comment section below who you want me to battle next time. Should I do Sabrina since we're already here or should I do Koga? Let me know, let me know. But I'm gonna I'm gonna train up off screen. I'm not gonna worry too much about Stud Muffin. He doesn't really need to actually well I, yeah, well yeah, I don't really need to worry about Stud Muffin because he's not gonna learn a ground type move. Because I gave Earthquake and Dig to Onyx. Um and I don't know if I can get another ground type move for Needle King. Needle King could be your Thunderbolter. So there's that. But yeah. So mostly I'm gonna focus on training up uh, Gyarados and Onyx. And look at look at our little Pidgeotto. I'm so proud of it. Pidgeotto. Pidgeot. I said Pidgeotto. Twice. So yeah. Anyway, guys, again, let me know who you want me to battle in the next uh, episode down below. Otherwise, we'll see you next time, guys. Stay sharp, everyone.